What's going on guys? It's your boy Terry by React here and we are back with another reaction. Um Attack on Time. Today we'll be doing episode Wow. What is it? 14? I think it's 14. <laughs> I don't know. We're doing three episodes today. Let me see here. Cause I think it's episode 14 through 16 we're doing today. Right? Yeah. Episode 14 through 16 we have on the agenda for today. So, you guys know what's been happening. Eren sealed the hole. Um, sauce moments. Great moments. Okay, so I'm guessing we're going to go deeper into this situation now with, um, what is it? Levi kind of accepting him into the to the to the survey corps, which is badass, because that's what he Aaron always wanted. But he's gonna be under Levi's supervision, which is pretty dope. So, I'm I just want to know what's what's gonna happen moving forward now. Are people gonna scorn him because they know he's a titan now. Are they gonna celebrate him because he helped? Um, are they gonna be looking at him as just a weapon? You know what I'm saying? A lot of questions here. But it is, um, you guys are saying to look out for subtle hints and stuff. And I'm watching. I'm paying attention to certain things so that when things come up, they're not, you know, they, they're like, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I'm looking for those things. So thank you guys for giving me that um, kind of heads up to look out for certain things that are there. Because I have missed a couple of things um, when it comes on to, like, you know, when was he injected with this thing? And you guys said there was a small flashback in like episodes two and three, I think. Um, so, but I missed it. So, um, so that's great. It's awesome, man. It's, I'm just looking forward to see what's going to happen next. So if you guys want to see an in-depth review of, of my last reaction, go ahead and check out my last reaction for episodes 12 and 13. Okay. Um, so I thank you guys for watching, but we're going to jump into these reactions right now. Link down in the description. Go watch those reactions, okay? I'm about to go record this jump. Thank you guys for watching as always. It's your boy Terabar Reacts. See you guys for the review. All right. Let's talk about these three episodes, man. Um, these three episodes were pretty calm. Pretty calm. I was learning more about the Titans. And, you know, the stance. The trial was nuts. But it was all a plan by the Survey Corps to get custody of Eren. Um, so, I like the conversation that Pixis had with Erwin. Her, I keep saying Erwin. It's Irwin. It's Commander Irwin. I love that conversation. That conversation was basically two people. He, he basically got the perspective from Pixies. Because Pixies know that they're all gonna they're gonna try to kill him. And he's like, I don't want I don't want him to die. Because you know, he's he's seen what Aaron is about. He had close interaction, you know, asking him that that moment they had on the on top of the wall um so he's had that close interaction with Aaron knowing the type of person he is you know what i mean so they devised a plan even though we didn't find out till after that it was their plan they devised a plan to get him out from the trial which is you know to let him prove himself in the field and basically the whole levi beating him up thing was basically um, part of the plan too you know what I'm saying even though in the moment I thought it was a test like he was pushing him to see if he will would resort into turning into the Titan right then and there um, so that he went a bit too far though he kicked a tooth out <laughs> you know what I mean like that wasn't cool at all but yes but they did the plan worked and they got his custody him in custody but then now it came down to the enlistments and and stuff like that uh last the the second episode episode 13 
was basically just um what's her name uh Hajj. i can't remember her name this the the one that's running the test on the titans um hajni i think it's hajni <laughs> i can't remember her name is kind of funny um weird name i've never heard it in anime before <laughs> you know so it's it's a bit off there but yeah but it's very exciting um second episode learning more about that depriving them of sunlight they go docile i mean this was mentioned before that they're not as active as night at night as they are in the daytime but i never knew it had to do with sunlight you know what i'm saying um i thought it was just like they're resting <laughs> you know what i mean just like anybody else they rest at night um so it that was cool to know um also their tolerance for pain we all know that they don't really feel pain you know what i mean so because they just grow back their body parts and look like the nape of their neck is the only weakness that they have they tested that um so i think the craziest thing that happened during these episodes was at the end um in the last episode was the amount of people that turned away from the survey corps and and the thing about i respect what commander Irwin did i really do respect what he did like he told him the truth like listen bruh this is no joke the mortality rate around these parts is 30 <laughs> percent okay we these titans don't play around you make a mistake you get dropped easily so we need people who are serious, who are willing to give their lives. It's like, bro, you're probably only going to live for four years doing this. Because that's like, you know what I'm saying? That's the rate of how things are going. Like the average lifespan of everybody that draw, that joins the survey court is four years. Okay? So, you're willing to die in four years? Hey, by all means, join. But know what you're getting into understand what you get in i'm glad he didn't hide the fact he didn't cherry you know what i'm saying put no cherry on top you know make it seem like it's sweet and it's a bed of roses like he never did that he just tell told them straight up this is gonna be tough it's it's a tough life you know you might lose your life doing this so are you willing to give your life doing this and i'm so happy that he did that because you don't want to get into a war not knowing what you're getting into at least they have a choice it, you know what i'm saying in in the real army once you join the army if you decide not to fight you can't just leave the army <laughs> you know what i'm saying you gotta spend some time in jail for not wanting to do what you're doing you know what i'm saying they, you're not gonna get that it's not treason you know like if you back down from a from a from fighting and stuff like that but you will get court-martialed because you refuse to do your military duties right so i mean at least they get a choice man so yeah so i'm glad the the, the reconnection between everybody I, i'm i'm not surprised that the group that stayed i'm not surprised at them i expected them to stay um who Sasha kind of surprised me I didn't expect Sasha to stay blah potato girl I didn't expect her to stay um yeah I think she's the only one that really surprised me I, I was surprised that that Annie left that surprised me I thought she would have stayed but because she she needs to be in the survey corps but um she I'm surprised she left to go be with the with the brigade the police brigade brigade yeah so i'm i'm surprised at her definitely surprised at that but i'm looking forward to to seeing where where they're going to take the story now because now they're heading out on this expedition to go take back war maria and get to this basement so due to the fact that this anime kills people i'm expecting somebody that we've gotten used to to die during this during this expedition i'm expecting it because now they've set a precedent in this anime whereas in 
they're making you getting used to characters and then they kill them and then they're not waiting until season seven to do it <laughs> you know people die out here in these streets you know what i'm saying so they don't care character that we love or hate they will kill them <laughs> right so i'm expecting somebody to to die hopefully it's not somebody that i've grown attached to in in certain way um in the story because it's gonna it's it is going to eat me up i'm gonna be i'm gonna be mad about it okay i don't like when characters of mine that i that i love that i've seen for a while now um getting used to them and then they just cut them off like i'll I was like, why did they kill Eren? You know what I'm saying? I was saying Mikasa was going to take over the story, which is so not the case. Eren came back. Now he's a titan. So, um, but it's a great story nonetheless, man. Opening, absolute trash. This new opening is absolute trash. They need to get... They, <laughs> that was... Not a good decision on their part. Um, absolutely trash opening, the new opening. Um, also, everything else, still great. Voice acting, um, the animation. Um, I want to talk about the, the, the animation, not um, not so much because there wasn't anything. There wasn't like super movements or anything like that. You know what I'm saying? Like There wasn't any action sequence for you to judge like animation like stuff like that that we were doing in these episodes is pretty easy to do in an animation so it's not anything you know over the top where you can say man that's fluid how did they get it to do that you know what i'm saying so animation still very good though still very good um and also the um there was some good good osds they're playing in the midst of the episodes i liked it um but overall these were three very good episodes so thank you guys for watching man it's been awesome thank you guys so much for supporting these videos you guys have been smashing the like buttons leaving comments man really appreciate it hope you guys appreciate the reactions too i know it it's your boy terabyte reacts i'm out terror squad because oh my god it has been some weekend for me um hope you guys enjoyed the one punch man episodes with one two things if you have not seen it yet go ahead and check it out um i did that in a little bit of my spare time over the weekend i just knocked six episodes out hopefully i can get the other six out by the end of this weekend if you have not seen my one punch man reactions um go and check them out now on the channel okay thank you guys for watching make sure you leave a like and a comment on this video i would really appreciate it thanks for staying with me throughout this review it's your boy Terabyte Reacts, and peace.